Hi everybody, it's Christina from Card Making Magic. Today I'm using the Complete Card and Box die set from the 6x6 collection, along with the diamond trellis, the fancy nesting squares, and we're going to make it a really special card, so I'm using items from the Love and Marriage stamp set. All my collection is available at Craft Stash. And for today's card, I'm going to use a cream and white colour scheme. So let's start with some die cutting. So from some cream card and the box set, I have cut two pieces of card. And then from some white card and the card making element, I have cut my base. From the stitched mat I have cut another layer in white. Then with with love I have cut my main piece in vellum and I have cut the words three times and I'm going to stack these together and add them to my vellum piece. With the diamond trellis I've taken the solid piece and I have cut two in cream and one in white. And then with both dice together I have cut one in cream and one in white. And they're going to layer up like this. This one is for the inside of the card. Now with the other sentiment I have again cut the base with some vellum and I've cut the words in cream and they are also going to be stacked together and added to the vellum piece. Now with some white card and the nesting squares if you count the smallest die as number one then I'm taking die number two, die number three and die number four and I'm going to tape those together on my card so that they can't move and I'm going to cut that out four times and that will give me four frames that are all the same size. Now out of the middle will come this piece, but don't throw that away, you can always use that on another project. So with all the die cutting done, now let's put this piece together. We're going to glue the white mat, the white diamonds onto the cream mat and the cream diamonds onto the white mat and then with the other diamond mat we're going to take the stitched layer and we're going to glue those together. Now once you have these glued together the one with the stitched mat is going to line the inside of your card and one of these is going on the box and the other is going on the front of your card. Now before I add this to my card, I'm going to wrap this with some white lace and some cream ribbon and I'm going to glue those on the back so that they will stay in place. And now so that I don't add too much bulk to my card, I've avoided the lace with my tape. So I've just added this to the back and this is now going to sit on the front of my card. So I've also done the same to the one that's going to sit on the front of the box. Now we've got the card front done and we've got the inside line. So now let's glue these four pieces together. So what we're going to do is we're going to glue them so that they sit like this on each other. So once you have these glued, you're now going to add them so that they're offset on the other section. And then behind the pieces that won't be seen, you're going to add some foam tape. Now once you've done that, you can add these to your card front. And just to make sure that they don't fall off, I'm going to add a little bit of extra glue. Now 
now with the little bits of the sentiment that will actually catch the framework I'm just going to add some spots of glue behind that area and that will fasten in along there now the other one I'm going to glue to the inside of my card so that it sits in there Now before we dress the card, we're going to go ahead and make the box.
there you have a really special wedding card the inside is lined both are decorated with flowers so I hope you've enjoyed the video and if you have please join me on the next one and I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.